Hey guys, um, today we have um had to deal with a PC. Um, as you see, there is a hard drive behind uh this Xbox 360 hard drive that I have purchased. Um, uh, that my school is giving away free desktops, but um, you see they have this Chrome stuff on it, so that hard drive is useless. It's infected with Chrome. There's no way to actually reset it from that. So uh, I bought a 360 hard drive, or I just found one laying around because I have a bunch of them from a while ago, and uh. I put that in, then I had a Windows 7 professional disk in, and this 360 hard drive has about the same memory as that Windows hard drive in there. I see, I first tried to use my old, one sec guys, my older Windows um, hard drive back to my Windows XP computer, so this hard drive I tried placing it in there. That was infected, so that didn't work. I have that computer in there. So I see guys, since the hard drive didn't work, I was really stumped, uh, so I did this, I disconnected the hard drive in there, and I inserted the 360 hard drive, the one that I told you is no longer compatible, my 360 piece got infected and whatnot, so I inserted that hard drive, and apparently that hard drive has enough memory just to be reset and to be placed on Windows, 10, on Windows 7. So, that was the way I fixed it, and uh, that if you have a problem with Chrome or whatnot, that's how you fix it, pretty much. you, The hard drive in there is pretty much scrap, because that hard drive is infected with Chrome, and there's no possible way to actually restore it back to its old form, so you have to buy like a new hard drive and place it in there, and then reset it and put it on Windows 7, as you see I'm doing. Because my school decided to place it on Chrome for some reason, and I don't know why, but that's kind of retarded. So, um, that's pretty much it for the video, guys, and enjoy it. Thanks.